Special meeting underway tonight aimed at solving crime, vandalism, and trash issues that some say plague the uptown area of Corpus Christi. That's the area near City Hall and the county courthouse. That meeting being organized by a nonprofit group called the Uptown Neighborhood Initiative. Our Bill Churchwell is there live tonight to tell us more about what's going on there. Bill? That meeting happening here behind us on the corner of Leopard and Waco Street, an area, if you might recall, it was just last month when police investigated a murder happening here. Now the business where this is happening at, you can see the doors here are actually boarded up because of vandalism. Now on the agenda tonight, the hiring of private security to police the uptown area. To give you a better idea of the area we are talking about, uptown is 2.2 square miles from North Upper Broadway to Port Avenue along Leopard, Antelope, and Lipan Streets. If approved, the security force would police that area overnight from 7 p.m. to 7 a.m. every day in an effort to protect residents, business owners, and employees. Now, property owner Darlene Gregory says the issue has to do with the growing number of homeless in the area. Well, Uptown is plagued by vandalism, and by vandalism I mean either defecation or urination on buildings, on sidewalks, or simply destruction of those properties. Now, the Uptown Neighborhood Initiative is a local grassroots nonprofit organization founded back in 2010 whose members are business owners and residents and employees in Uptown. The group has also taken part in several cleanup events. Since it was formed, the group has removed more than 20 tons of trash off the streets and mowed 2.2 square miles of overgrown lots, as well as, get this, helped demolish six buildings at no cost to the city or owners and back out here live among those that are in attendance at this meeting tonight we have members of ccpd reporting live i'm bill churchwell now back to you